keep waiting. I hope you're still there. Can you see the dust fly? That's probably because I had more than four cups of coffee. I broke that one. Bottom's wet. I just got it out of the dishwasher. Daughter, if you're watching this. Hi everybody, welcome back. I just filmed this whole thing and I didn't turn the record button on. I did that. I did that. You're sitting in the cupboard where I keep my coffee cups. Don't ever say you've never been in the cupboard because you're in the cupboard now. Getting it done north of seven has started a new hashtag. Hashtag my favorite coffee cup. And I'm joining into that because why not? It's another hashtag. We have a lot of hashtags going around these days. I am still waiting for someone to make hashtag cook Rob steak because he needs, he needs a steak. Rob does. So in this video, Roland and his wife, they both showed their favorite coffee cups, but I'm going to take it a little bit further. I'm going to show you a couple coffee cups that I have because why why wouldn't you why wouldn't you want to see my coffee cups? This, let's start out with this one. Isn't that cute? My daughter had this made for me and gave it to me for Christmas. Four reasons I love being a GMA. Well, there should be six reasons on there now. And one on the way, which would be seven. So daughter, if you're watching this, we need to change we we need to we need to change this up a little bit because it should be say seven. Seven reasons I like you being a GMA with faces all the way around. So yeah, there you go. There's that one. Now I have a lot of Ray Dunn. Do you guys know what Ray Dunn is? Coffee cups. I do have quite a few of these. They break very easily. I'll tell you that. These break. I've broken quite a few of these coffee cups. But bottom's wet. I just got it out of the dishwasher. Ray Dunn. See? Ray Dunn. Yeah. Ray Dunn smile. We have Ray Dunn play. And I know I have more Ray Dunn coffee cups, but they're in the but you get the picture. They, they say something. Rob and I started when we would go on vacation collecting coffee cups and we got this one from the Outer Banks. We got two of these from the Outer Banks. I like coffee cups from different places that we that we may go. I have quite a few of them but they're not like right in this cupboard. I've got this one this says Portagus Lie Shellfish Bar and Grill. Don't know. Not sure where we got this one, but we have a pink one and a blue one. You know, one for me, one for Rob. I have quite a few that just aren't in this cover, and I'm not going to go searching right now. But this is Rob's favorite coffee cup. It's got this deer on it, of course. He's a man. He likes manly cups. Although he does, he will drink out of this. And right now I'm drinking my coffee. Let me get this put together. I hope that you're still here. I hope you're not bored with this. I'm drinking my coffee out of the pink one. These were in the dishwasher and I just took the liberty of pulling them out so you could see them. I did have one that said mom, but I broke that one. Now in my coffee, I personally like this. I have a milk allergy, so this, this, doesn't affect my stomach like milk would. Milk, it would just be bad. But I like vanilla, vanilla in my coffee. Like every day I do this. Sometimes I drink four cups a day, maybe sometimes more in my videos if I'm talking quickly. That's probably because I had more than four cups of coffee. If moms were flowers, I'd pick you. Same daughter, same said daughter that got me this cup, which we need to add to this cup got me this cup and this cup I keep on my dresser and I have stuff in it like earphones and stuff and, can you see the dust fly I don't know there's a lot of dust in here but I have like computer -y things in there Woo! and dust evidently so that's what I like and Rob drinks sweet and low he likes, he's a sweet and low kind of guy. I tried to get him on a healthier sugar thing. I tried stevia. He, he wasn't a fan of stevia. He wanted no part of the stevia. And then I have honey in this one. Mm -hmm. My little mason jar I put, you know when you go to KFC and they give you all the packets, just all the packets, I, I just saved them and put them in here. And this one, you know the little sing, single drink packets that you put in um, water bottles. I keep them in this mason jar looking thing. We used this at my daughter's wedding and we had quite a few of them. So I repurposed this. See? 
I repurposed it and put single drink pouches in here. I like these. Rob doesn't drink these too much. I'm a fan though. What kind of coffee do we drink, you ask? Hold on, I'll go get the box. McCafe. We are K-cup people at this house. Only because Rob drinks coffee at 4 a.m. And I don't normally get up until later than 4 a.m. And the coffee pot normally shuts off. And if I wanted coffee, I would have to reheat it in the microwave. So, so we're K-cup people here. But we do have backup. We have a backup coffee plan here with, hold on, wait for it. This little thing. So if we ever run out of K-cups, then we have that. We also have an actual coffee pot here. I don't have any filters for that at the moment. I'll probably need to buy some, but I, I have an actual coffee pot. We put this back. We use that maybe on the weekends when we're both home. Yeah, we do that. Now wait, wait for this because I love coffee. I have, hold on, wait for it. Keep waiting. I hope you're still there. Now this is broken. I probably should get an, need a new one of these, but this is like an Italian coffee maker where you put the water in the bottom and then it has that little filter. You put the coffee in the filter in this thing and in that thing and then you put it in there, fill this with water, put that in there yep. and then you just screw it on and then you put it on your stove and then it percolates percolator it percolates in here and this is really good I drink that and with that it's like espresso it is espresso I use this I use that for that pot so there's my coffee haul now I thought it would be cool because I've seen other people do this and I just think it would be cool I think that I'm gonna start a, a thing buy me a cup of coffee just because I thought it would be fun I, I don't know a couple people have mentioned Michelle do you have a P.O. box no I don't have a P.O. box we haven't done that yet we haven't really even looked into getting a P.O. box because people have said I'd like to send you this or this or that I thought I would do this buy me a cup of coffee thing which I, I don't know I feel kind of weird doing things like that like I feel kind of weird um getting a P.O. box because it's like I'm not asking, but people are asking me, so it's kind of weird because it's just, on my part, it's just weird to do, but I'm going to probably start that, buy me a cup of coffee, and if I did, I'll put it in the description below, but if I didn't, that's because I just found it too weird to do, I, I don't know, so anyway, oh, oh, let me show you my tin, whoa, whoa, you ready? I have this and normally in here I keep my k-cups I need to fill it back up I also like have Amazon Prime delivery for k-cups so I don't run out I hope they're gonna deliver soon because I'm probably gonna run out I also do that with my hairspray they deliver it every two weeks because that's just I don't want to run out so I have like that auto auto ship thing happening I do that but anyway there you go that's what we do for coffee in this house so if you want to join the hashtag um let me look and see what it is again oh Roland oh Roland oh Roland I spelled Roland's name wrong I did I did that I did that hashtag my favorite cup of coffee with Roland and his wife here see there they are they're doing their own thing Let's uh, support Roland in this cool hashtag. Because it is kind of a cool hashtag. Still waiting for that hashtag. Let's cook raw, cook raw a steak. Hashtag my favorite cup of coffee. I'll link Roland's channel in my description. And that buy me a cup of coffee if I'm not weirded out by it. I'll put that down there too. So anyway. I will see you in my next video. Consider subscribing. Because we have fun around here. And it's kind of cool. So consider subscribing. I'll see you next time. Bye.